Hello, everyone. Today we're going to talk about how are the digestive, respiratory, and circulatory systems related. These three work very closely together. So we're going to review very quickly the functions that they do and then how they work together. First, we're going to start by reviewing the digestive system. And let's remember that this is the one that breaks down food to be absorbed in the bloodstream. We obtain the nutrients with our digestive system. Then we're going to see the respiratory system. This system is in charge of absorbing oxygen from the air so that your organs can work. Also, it cleans waste gases such as carbon dioxide from our blood. The respiratory system, uh, when we works like this when we uh, obtain oxygen from the environment it starts by passing through the nostrils then it goes down through the pharynx going down to the trachea then the two bronchi and then the two lungs the circulatory system is in charge of pumping blood to all of our body from our hair, head sorry to our toes the circulatory system is going to do this. Yeah, blood is going to pump from the heart through the arteries and the veins, and it's going to go all to our body, from the heart to the body parts, and then back to the heart. So, concluding, the circulatory system distributes oxygen obtained through the respiratory system and nutrients obtained by the digestive system to different parts of our body. So the benefits that we get from the digestive system, which are nutrients, and the respiratory system, which is oxygen, is distributed to our body or through our body uh, through the circulatory system. So that's how these three are related. I hope this helps you understand a little better. And well, I will see you next time. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.